Hey everyone, I've got a little uh, first impressions video for you today. It's of this case. It's the Black Blackberry convertible case for the playbook. I've had it coming up a week. I decided to go for a new case over the original foam sleeve because I've started taking it, taking the playbook out outside the house, and I thought I'd need a little bit more protection. And plus. It's, it's fully protected even if you've got the case open whereas if you put it in a foam sleeve it's either in the sleeve or out the sleeve so I'll take you on a little bit little uh, look around the case to start with uh, tell you what I think about it and that's pretty much it so on the front you have a nice shiny Blackberry logo you open it up and your playbook sits in a little hard silicone case. On the top you have your microphone holes. I don't know if you can see that. There they are. Microphone and there. Then you have your power button and your skip forward, skip backwards and play and pause button. Then you have a hole for your 3.5mm jack and obviously the, the speakers aren't affected because they're in the corner. And on the bottom you have cutouts for your three ports and um, nothing on the side and nothing on the other side because there are no buttons or ports on the side. On the back you have a little hole for your camera and a little embossed bit which is for the case which I'll, uh, the stand feature which I'll show in a minute. Then. I'm trying to get the light here, it doesn't seem to be great, but there is an embossed Blackberry logo, there, there we go, embossed Blackberry logo and Blackberry on the side. So this, also, this case also doubles up as a stand, so you've got two settings, you've got the first one, which is that, seems pretty sturdy. Then you have that one, which gives you a more angled view. And it seems like it is a decent stand. Just turn the playbook back on. One thing I would I will say is that this case is very well made. There's no loose threads nothing like that it's pretty nice, there is a little bump you probably won't be able to see that but there is a little bump there where they've notched out for the stand but that's not really a big deal feels solid um, should protect your playbook a bit better than the original sleeve because it's actually in a hard silicone case as you can see, you can take it out of the case here. There's the playbook. There's the case. So, yeah, I think this is a really good buy. I bought mine off Amazon. It was pretty cheap. Just leave it stand up. Um, cost me about. £12, which isn't bad. Some of the non the non genuine ones cost that, so and they use little straps in the corners to hold your playbook in. I wasn't really happy about doing that, so I went for the genuine one. Um pretty happy. I'd say if you could find it at a bargain price like I did, I'd say snap it up, if it's your style obviously. I like the way it looks, it gives it the playbook a nice executive look, don't you agree? Um, makes it look like a little A5 notebook, which I actually have a leather bound A5 notebook and it matches in my bag nicely. If somebody, well, I don't know if this, this would play out very well, but say somebody who's having a look in your bag 
trying to steal something, all they would see is a little notebook. Or they would just take your bag. That's that's kinda of a bad a bad saying I guess. Um yeah. Overall, nice sturdy case. If you get a discount, even better. I think they retail at thirty four ninety nine. So if you get a discount off of that then it's well worth it. Um about the video situation, I'm going to try and get a video out every week. Uh, probably on a Monday between now and Christmas. Um, I don't know if there's going to be any G4 videos in there because I'm still, well, I'm still deciding what the primary use of it is. So, yeah, that'll probably be early 2012 when I decide what upgrades I want for it. Um, I think that's about it. Thanks for watching. Bye.